are in the midst of night three of Sacramento's curfew put in place after a weekend of violence, vandalism, and looting. All erupting after the sun went down following mostly peaceful protests. Yeah, dozens were arrested, as you know, in the first two nights, and the city says the curfew will continue through the weekend. So a few days to go now. CBS 13's Laura Hafley is live in Sacramento with what things look like right now. Laura, sounds peaceful. And it is just moments ago, protesters clearing out of Cesar Chavez Park, and we asked several of them where they were headed, and they said home. Clearly trying to respect that 8 p.m. curfew, though we are several hours past that, so we will see if there are any arrests. As you can see, this park almost completely empty. And something different tonight uh, that we haven't seen for the past two nights is the fact that there is really no police presence at all. The only noticeable presence is their helicopter uh, circling above us. But besides that, I haven't seen a single police officer. The only uh, Law enforcement type agency that is here is the National Guard. They are standing in front of City Hall. But besides that, no police. We have not seen any demonstrators. We even did uh, a few laps around nearby streets. We went down J Street and we didn't see anything, anyone getting arrested. But again, that doesn't mean that we won't see some later tonight. Now, the trajectory today of the protest group was similar to the last two nights, beginning their evening at the Capitol on the East Steps, then marching here to Caesar. Chavez Park holding a very peaceful vigil and then again dispersing and heading home. So a very peaceful night here, but we will keep you updated with any developments uh, moving on throughout the night. Uh, certainly a relief to see things quieting down. Laura Hafley, thank you for that live report.